when we're looking at any of our kits, we're looking at three main things, which is insulation, isolation, and mass, and a combination of these three elements to get optimum acoustic performance. We'll go through to our first system. This is our M20 rubber sheets. This is often used as a director wall system. It's really popular in studios for anti-vibration on the wall, and you're not taking up too much space. We've then come away with a stud, leaving a five to 10 mil air gap as your isolation. And then from there, with our insulation, this is RW45 50 mil thickness to fill the void and stop sounds bouncing around in the cavity. And as Simon said before, you wanna add mass. So we've come ahead with our 15 mil Cineat acoustic plasterboard. The M20 is direct fixed onto the wall here. So this would be onto your brick or your masonry onto your party wall. This is glued on, but we also recommend using the appropriate fixing that suit the wall that it's being fixed onto. You leave an air gap. The deeper that you can leave this void between the M20 and between the stud, the better performance you're gonna get at low frequency. The insulation is the Rockwall RWA45, good absorption coefficient. The insulation, the isolation, and the mass. So the isolation is having this independent stud off the wall. The insulation is the absorber within the cavity, and the mass is the heavy stuff on the front. Onto our high mass products. So onto here, you can see our DB Cineat plasterboard. It's really high mass material and it's also really cost effective. This is one of our go-to products when trying to use mass on wall systems. From there, we've got our Dexound SY100. There is a self-adhesive backing, peel off. Be advised cutting it down to meter long lengths and then that makes ease of install. There is a non-adhesive version, Dexound 100. You would put that off using fixings and you would go ahead with your fire line finish. We always advise leaving a five mil expansion gap along the perimeter and film that with acoustic sealant. This is really important because acoustic sealant isn't hard setting, so it keeps that elasticity and it stops sound from being able to flank through any air gaps. So in summary, our high performance, high mass system consists of the 20 mil M20 rubber sheeting, an independent stud. We've got metal in the demo, but this could easily be timber. The RWA45, 50 mil to suit the cavity, the DB, Cineat board, 15 mil, 15 kg plasterboard, the TechSound SY100, self-adhesive, and then the 15 mil Fireline pink plasterboard to finish. Sealed around the perimeter, skim finished or tape and jointed, and then left for decoration. So thanks so much for coming on to watch our soundproofing kits videos today. If you need any more information, just click the link below, visit our website, pop us an email, or give us a quick call. We'll be happy to help.